Eddie Hearn, Matchroom Boxing. You are watching Sporting Icons. You don't need to be anywhere else. Right, so upload number six of the day. Tyson Fury is speaking about the Anthony Joshua fight. And this is what he had to say. I think 100%... The fight will happen, and I think we're going to know within the next couple of days where and when. I'm confident this fight's going to get made in the next few days. Tyson Fury statement. So, automatically for me, my initial reaction is good. He's talking about this fight in a positive way, rather than for the past few weeks in a negative way. How he could need a tune-up in inactivity, and John Fury's been saying that the, that the money won't be there, and all these kind of negative things. But now he's talking about it in a positive way. Now, he sat down with his team yesterday, so Sunday, with, um, I'm presuming, Bob Arum, because um, he's over there in Las Vegas, which is where Bob Arum lives. But I still haven't given uh, Bob Arum a call, actually, I should. But they've gone through the offers. Quite clearly, he's happy with them. And we've seen him dancing today on social media to some ACDC. Quite clearly, he's in a good mood. Why is he in a good mood? Because he's earning a whole lot of money to fight Anthony Joshua for Undisputed. Now, this video is not about who would win and how this fight goes. We'll talk about that as the fight gets closer. And I understand a lot of people will be still apprehensive about this fight happening. And I think a lot of the apprehension is down to Team Fury being quite so negative about it for quite some time. But ultimately, it is what it is. I know a lot of people are still going to stand by their guns and say, I don't think this fight's going to happen until I actually see both Fury and Joshua walk into the ring, touch gloves, the bell goes, and punches start flying. That's when we're really going to believe that the fight's on. And I understand that things do happen. Injuries happen. Um, in fact, quite a few people said, I bet Tyson Fury pulls out of injury. A few people said, well, I bet Anthony Joshua pulls out of injury. It's possible. I don't think either one of them would do it as a way to avoid the fight. I think if either of them do pull out through injury, it would be pretty genuine. Honestly, I do. I think both of these guys want the fight. And with the amount of money on the table, why wouldn't they? Of course you would. Anybody would, okay? And especially for a chance to create history of Undisputed. Now, him saying that within the next couple of days, that's great news. Will we find out when and where? I have no idea, as and when we will find out. I'd imagine we'll probably find out about a week or so after both uh, Joshua and Fury decide when and where the fight's going to be. Because obviously they're going to get all the promos together and create or arrange some uh, press conferences. It's probably going to be a virtual press conference, I would imagine. I'm guessing, of course, do the posters and all this kind of stuff. Then we'll find out exactly what's going to go on. Of course, they're going to want to get uh, the ticket details out there and how you can get the flights if it's going to be abroad. Hopefully, it's going to be here in the United Kingdom at Wembley Stadium. Not going to hold out too much uh, hope for that one. But either way, positive news from Tyson Fury. He is now 100% confident that this fight with Anthony Joshua is going to happen. So no more, please, from both sets of fan base for Joshua and Fury saying one is ducking the other one. Neither one of these guys are ducking. And if either one of them is even a little bit nervous about the fight or not entirely confident for the amount of money that these guys are going to get paid, I'll step in the ring with any of them. I'm telling you. And you will too, wouldn't you? Of course you would. Anyway, this fight's going to happen. Drop your thoughts below. Click thumbs up. Subscribe. Catch you on the next video.